Southeast leaders demand unconditional release of Mazin Namdekalo. Hmm. One fearless bishop have spoken up exactly what is happening in Nigeria and given a solution to it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Nigeria problem now have a solution though. Hmm. They say Tunumbu are currently this um, destroying people's business, which is Biafra's business in uh, uh, Ladibo. So please confirm this information. Hello, my wonderful people. Welcome back to Balabas Gis. If today is the first time you are coming across this wonderful channel, you are highly welcome. <laughs> if you they follow this, uh, or this, if you are my subscriber, thank you so much. Uh, but I want to all those who never subscribe to this channel to immediately subscribe and turn your notification bell for a quick update as it is hot. <laughs> Let me tell you something. Is it truth? Is it bitter? And is it pepper? The only truth to go serve us for the situation we will do for Nigeria. And let's look into the Wenge news we will get for hand today. <laughs> um, Simon Ekwa, we be PM, Biafra government in Ezai have raised alarm that my Azinam de Carlo is currently sick. <laughs> no be smart, you know. Uh, let's look into the whole Wenge news we will get for hand today. And uh, we will go take a one after the other. Southeast leaders demand release of Mazin Namdekalo to restore security and peace, tranquility in the region of Southeast. This is happening. I thought they 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 forget that uh, Mazin Namdekalo is in DSS. They have remembered again to talk about it. I tell you people that nothing but the truth. Once you realize where your problem is. Once you restore peace in Southeast, and now you have going straight to the point. Yes, now you people are coming. Go straight to the point. You have, let me tell you, the importance of youth. When you have fearless youth, when you have fearless youth as a father, ask what belongs to you with no fear because you have lions in your back. Your youth are lions. That's why I say that the that the Biafra, but I'm talking of Southeast now. The South is supposed to be a very wealthy and rich, well developed state, the whole state in Nigeria. But because you have chosen to be a monkey, they will not be throwing banana to you. That is why we are where we are today. Hmm. Let's go and look into the next update where we get for hand today. Hmm. Things are really happening. <laughs> they say one bishop, one bishop, don't come outside, blast Nigeria and tell them nothing but the truth. You will not hear it from me, but I want you to watch and listen to what this bishop, who have a lot of theory to talk here today, listen to what he talk. The exactly what we'll be saying here, the problem of Nigeria. And they are running away from it. Just listen. The summary of it. The summary of it is that we cannot run away from this stark reality that Nigeria has to be restructured. Whether it is the restructuring that gives more powers to states or a return to the regional arrangement of the past or the restructuring that allows restructuring that allows parts of the country that want to go and stand as independent nation whatever that restructuring means we must not run away from it And our position as bishop, and I must say now, I'm carrying you along as a diocese, is that if we continue to pretend that all is well, we will keep bleeding, bleeding profusely. And very soon, there might be nothing called Nigeria. Instead of our killing ourselves, 
under the pretext of remaining one indivisible on a, a, a nation. Some people say Nigeria's unity is non-negotiable. I want to see how it is negotiable. This thing, this thing is like marriage. You don't force two people to get married. We have been forced into a marriage that is hurting us. And every day we are dying and pretending to be one. Please, instead of our killing ourselves and there will be no Nigeria left, let us come to, come to a round table like this. Bring Nigeria as a cake. Bring one big knife and share the cake. Share the cake. Share the cake. Yeah, welcome back as I've watched that video. You know, um, some of them think that Nigeria don't have a, uh, a solution for what is going on in Nigeria. The solution is there, but the truth of the matter is that the evil in Nigeria don't want that solution to be unveiled. Because if they review the solution, there's a lot of hidden things that we Nigerians, we know. And uh, when Nigerians, those who are Nigerians, when they know this truth, everybody will say so we are sitting on this all this why and this is the reason why they don't want the truth to be to be reviewed in nigeria and uh, very very soon it will happen by force because the cop have already full and pointing at they are trying to mob as they can but the liquid is still leaking the leakage will expose them and people will be asking where this water is falling from. Let's check what is happening. It's very, very close. As we are speaking, it's very, very close. We tell you people about holding mass in Nambikalo. You are waking so many people and uh, very, very soon you will see them. <laughs> when we speak, you write it down because we are not true. We are not true. Hello, my wonderful people. <laughs> Uh, let's look into the Ogbenge news where we still get for hand today. Hmm. They say that uh, Mazi Simon Ekpa, the PM of the Afra government in SI, has raised alarm today concerning Mazi Namdekalu head. And this is what he said. He said, breaking. Mazi Namdekalu is seriously done. Can't open his eyes. Can't speak. His condition is very critical. And I am raising the alarm of danger. On his life to 80 percent and from scale of a one to ten i put it to eight i will put it to the politicians and those who participated in the kidnap and the extraordinary rendition that there will be no hiding place for you and everything around you hmm. this is happening before our time so um this is the alarm that uh Mazi simon epa raised today regarding Mazi namdekalo head condition and the uh, Mazi simon epa also went ahead and made this demand so let us read it at as well it's so to the to the m branch and um, biafra intelligence team we urge we urgently need every information about the dss boss the currently attorney general every information is needed from address below to everything you can bring <laughs> uh, things are happening things are going on that we don't know but things are really happening uh, but one thing that i want to assure them is that the greatest mistake that Nigeria, this is not as usual what you people used to do to the others. And the Carlo case is very, very different. Um, if anything happened to Madi and Carlo, and God forbid, nothing will happen to Madi and Carlo. But if in this life that anything happened to Madi and Carlo in DSS custody, um, this is not where we can say, Kanda, Kanda, let's get justice. There is no justice. This is what we call fire, flame. We go up and nothing can stop it. 
the flame will not go up in east we are telling you what we are seeing ahead listen this is what we are seeing ahead flare will not go up only in east but it will start in the north in in the north to the west before it will not get to the east this flame that i'm seeing the justice is not by by carrying black hat say we need justice no this justice that i'm talking that will happen there will be nothing like us rock and there will be no hiding place so those politicians they are on, they are not going to outside country because people in outside country will be waiting for them in even airport to make sure that they bring them down they will live inside the bush this is what we're seeing so if you don't want to see yourself in this condition you're a politician you are involved in kidnapping Mazen and the carlo release glue for a way to save Mazen and the carlo's life and release Mazen and the carlo immediately if you don't want this to happen so this is what we're seeing we are bringing out let's go and look into the next of when news what we get for hand today that is a trending video on internet today saying that uh, um according to the the video that uh, Tunumbu ordered the lock of a uh, Ladipo market. So we are going to play you the video for you to watch. And if you are in those areas, please kindly confirm this information uh, that is pumping up. Let us know what is going on where you are because a lot of things are going on. And I have told you people to locate your business to start is but since you have refused and they uh, keep on being in your enemy's land. That is your own business. But let's bring the, the video up. Unlock everywhere. My people at the Benguna, this way of Bongo News. Lagos, they don't start again. Oh, now, Tunumbu don't give order. He told us to go punish the people. Oh, now, for me, now they can't lock this market. If they see them everywhere, they lock up. Oh. If they see them, oh, now, so we they see them. All the market for them, they don't lock them. Oh. They tell us the Bia France, they make go house, and I say no. He don't read to. Everybody don't they stand there like this. They don't they stand there. And I say, bro, you talk, they don't they stand there. They don't let. My people, my people, people, they stand there like this, and they follow you talk. To. So. Everybody don't they stand there. They don't ready for a different market. They say the bongo that it come from Baba Metumbu. Say the way they come from who? Everywhere don't they see up? They don't ride who? They be say the teruna. Say you go red, people no believe them. Make everybody they go back to Baba land and I say no. He don't let for a different like this. And they cannot talk and say. See if he start for this market like this show. And as you see, I don't stand already. Everybody in uh, the palace. See me could go be a frown and say no. Nah, he don't lock up. Kurumbu soon and no vote for that. Nah, he don't give all that they lock like this for no reason. You know. Red do, Papa, he don't read. Yeah, welcome back, my people. So this is the video that we are talking about of what is happening in Lagos State. So uh, if this information is accurate, please kindly identify that this is happening to you. If you are among those people in this particular market, um, you know things are really happening right now as we are speaking. So anybody need to be careful, be very very careful wherever you are in Nigeria. Um, the to, the the thing is that they lie to you people in so many things. They are lying to you people, and these people are there, but you have eyes, you can see. You only see where you go and come back, but you don't see the things that is happening where you are. There is one comment that I want to reply here. I want to reply this comment. There is one person that comment. That is one fool who come to my comments. Um, do you know what this fool right? He said that um, you just joined YouTube and you are looking for money. <laughs> this is so funny. And uh, I'm sending this message in case of if you go, if maybe if you come across this message as well, give me your address and give me the address of your family, your poor family. I will help them. I will remove them from poverty. Let me to prove to you that we are not here. We are not looking for money. 
I will remove your family from poverty. Okay, guys, please don't forget to share this video. Very, very important. Share this video. And I'm going to see you in the next update. Stay tuned.